You are watching a VCA exclusive only here on YouTube. And don't forget to like and subscribe to receive the latest updates and news. Ladies and gentlemen, the following contest is scheduled for one fall with a 15 minute time limit and it is for the VCA Junior Vader Championship. Introducing first, the challenger, representing the gold flush. He's from Chicago, Illinois, the Black Mamba, Q. And introducing his opponent, he is from Memphis, Tennessee, tonight. He is your reigning and defending BCA Junior Vative Champion, Michael Clark! And here we go, ladies and gentlemen. This is a Junior Bay of Championship contest here at BCA Wrestling's Mega Fest. The champion, Michael Clark, defending against the Gold Flush member Q. And right now, Q trying to punk out one Michael Clark. And you know what? Gold Flush needs this momentum because it will be tanked. Oh, here's another lockup. And Q immediately bats Michael Clark into the corner. Oh, swung and missed. And if that ain't a, if that ain't punching your punk card right there, and look at the look at, look at the look of Q right there. And now Q a little bit frustrated right now, but like I said, the Gold Flux needs all the momentum tonight that they going they need because it's Tank that will be defending the VCA Heavyweight Championship in the over the top rope battle royal. And ladies and gentlemen, Tank will be entering that contest, that battle royal at number one. And now the Black Mamba Q in firm control of this contest. And now Michael Clark sweeps the leg. Immediate kick out by, by Q. Oh, Q got the first shot in. Knee to the gut. Followed up with the right hand. And now Q shoots Michael Clark off the ropes. Michael will reverse it. Oh, do si -do, around the road we go. Oh, Q catches the foot. Michael Clark lands back on his feet. Oh, head center takedown. Q just took an all drag. Followed up by a drop kick. And yeah, Q like, hold on now. Hold on now. Yeah, club and blow to the back of the back of Q. Michael Clark, the longest reigning 
Junior Veda champion in history. Oh, hamstring. Uh oh. Caught him. And takedown by Q. And as I was saying, Michael Clark has held that title for a I think a little over a year and two months now. And now black the black mamba looks like he's gonna toss Michael Clark right out here to the outside. And like I tell fans all the time, there is no padding out here. There's no padding out here. This is straight concrete. And now Q making his way to the outside here. He's gonna be in pursuit of Michael Clark. Oh, uh, Michael Clark was trying to fight back, but Q. Oh! That would that would cave your chest in right there. Now cover. Cow. And Michael Clark kicks at it too. And Q talking trash to Michael Clark's grandmother that's here at ringside, as she does every week. She's here to support her grandson. And now Michael Clark starting to fight back here. Oh my goodness! My devastated drop kick. That drop kick was on point and Michael Clark might be out. Eric and cover, and that's not going to get it done against Michael Clark. And now look at this. Q choking Michael Clark right in front of the referee. Now, Q sets up Michael Clark for a textbook suplex. One, two. And now, Michael Q says he's done with Michael Clark. But that's the thing, that's kind of like the Achilles heel with the Black Mamba. He does too much talking and not taking care of business in that ring. But I cannot deny his, his talent. He's a former television champion, a former multi-time junior battle champion, and a multi-time tag team champion. Oh, tell to world around it where we go. And sticks, sticks him with the a DDT. And now the referee. And now Michael Clark, he's back to a standing pace. Oh, a close line, make it two of them. Oh my goodness. What an insecurity by Michael Clark. Hamstring, back elbow, faster mark. And now, Michael Clark is now in the, is now in the driver's seat. And now, Clark says that's it. He might be positioning Michael Clark for, that, for his patented frog splash. And now Michael, he's going to the top rope. And now, I think the referee is checking on, he's checking on, on Q. Wait a minute. I told you, that is why right there, he's a black mamba. He used the referee 
to make sure Michael lost his footing on the top row. Suplex and Q rolls through, rolls through. Falcon arrow, cover. Now grabs the leg. Round two. Th he let him go. And it's actually saying that he's doing it again. And Q, he had to match one. And now Q, springboard, springboard, moonsault. He got his knees up. One, two, three. You know, right before we came out, I heard someone say, hey, Dwayne. Is that one of your prostitutes over there? Oh, wow. But anyway, Dwayne, let's get down to business. Just tonight, tonight, I've been waiting for for a long time. I told you that I had someone for you. But I never told you who. <laughs> Just know that this person is in agreement to take away your hardcore championship. And that's good enough for me. Now you really thought it was gonna be my man Johnny Ewan, right? No, no, no. Not Johnny, because he's gonna beat the hell out of you enough. And plus, I've got something in store for the Memphis Cowboys. And someone's gonna See it real soon. Now, Dwayne, after you get through with your beating tonight, I'm going to slap the hell out of this wannabe preacher lady who's always trying to trash talk me. Well, you know, I already knocked the hell out of her once, but this time she would not be getting up. And then, 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 I'm going to slap the hell out of that truck from across the bridge because I've been on her for one for years. But you know, but you know, she hasn't even came to the shows real lately. And I know why. Because she's scared. She's scared because the fact that I will slap the hell out of her. And then, if any woman wants to put their nose in my business like Tiny's daughter, I slap the hell out of that trap too. So my advice for all the women that are in here, my advice for every woman in here, is do what you're exactly what you're doing, and that's being spectators. Because the first woman that steps into my world, I'm gonna slap the bitch. I mean, say for instance, say for instance last week, Rick Motor's wife, right? I was seconds away last week and kicking your fat ass. Okay. And lastly, lastly, Dwayne, after your body's drugged across this ring tonight and severely beaten, I would say true to my words. And that is, I'm going to go and slap the hell out of your mama and your sister. And that's right, I'm gonna bring them into this tree and be both of their asses for always trying to trash talk me. Oh, oh, oh. So what you gonna do, Dwayne, huh? What you gonna do, Dwayne, huh? You gonna put your hands on a woman again? Guess what, Dwayne? Your opponent tonight is none other than this. And his opponent, he is your reigning and defending BCA Hardcore Champion, Mr. Dwayne Wise. champion.
championship. And Dwayne White, his back is, is against the wall in this contest. Daniel Miraculous and Dwayne White, they've met before for the Hardcore Championship. But not with these states, because you have the general manager, Tara Ray, and the Memphis Cowboy, Johnny Ewan, here on the outside here. And now, Dwayne, he turns his attention to Johnny Ewan. And now, Daniel Miraculous got the, the cheap shot in on Dwayne. Swinging neck breaker by Dwayne, by Mike, by Daniel. And now, Daniel's telling Johnny, give him something. He don't care what it is. And Johnny Ewan, oh, oh man, you gotta be careful with those signs here. The, the edge of those signs will cut you like a knife. Daniel Miraculous, what up? My goodness, look how dented that paint, that cooking sheet is. And now drop down into a cover. But there's still a lot of fight left in Dwayne. And Dwayne has had his issues with Johnny Ewing. But you have to give the assist, just like in those matches, you have to give the assist to Tara Wright. And Daniel wearing Dwayne out with that chair. The real hardcore champion. And the referee can't do anything with you and, and Ray out here because this is a hardcore match and anything goes. And Tara Ray cheering Daniel Miraculous on. And Tara Ray is systematically trying to shut down Dan Dwayne here and take that hardcore championship. Oh my God! And that knife edge chop. And now Daniel brings Dwayne up to a standing base, shoots him out of court. No! Dwayne with the reversal. And Daniel ran into that, uh, that uh, neutral corner. I couldn't see what type of object was that was wedged into those, those turnbuckles. And now Daniel suffer, is suffering the wrath of Dwayne White. And the pitfalls count anywhere in the building. I mean, they can fight all the way into the session stand. My goodness, what a shot. And I think we're dealing with a pissed off Dwayne White. And now Dwayne uh, back suplex on the hardest part of the ring. And Dwayne is like, oh, what do we got over here? Now, and now Dwayne, he's got that, he's got that cowboy bell. Oh, but Daniel beats Dwayne to the punch, and he is just beating the crap out of Dwayne with that cooking sheet. And these shit. And now, Daniel 
still, he still, he still putting more objects into the ring here. And now Daniel, my goodness. He is whipping Dwayne White. What is this, home eco economics? And now, the, Daniel with that tennis, tennis racket. Oh my God. And Daniel Miraculous has just been unleashed here in this contest. And Dwayne White, he's in the drop zone. And what do I mean when I say drop zone? You're about to find out if you've never seen a Daniel Miraculous match. And now just scratching the back of, of Dwayne. And now, uh-oh. A knee shot, make it two to the midsection, and Daniel might be looking for that gotcha. Oh no, counter, counter, counter by Dwayne. Dwayne with the power bomb on Daniel on that, on that chair. And now, he they just smacking him. Hey, Daniel, you gotta be careful of that merging lane over there. And now, oh my goodness, Daniel just jacked the jaw of Dwayne. Oh. Uppercut by Daniel. Oh, right of what? Drop down. One, two, and Dwayne, he's being distracted by Johnny Ewan. Come on. And now, Dwayne is telling Johnny Ewan, come on. And now Ewan, he's coming up. Face Buster. Face Buster, oh, low blow by Tara. And it's legal. That's the thing about this match, it's legal. Oh, Daniel. Skull crushing for Larry. One, two. Oh my God, we got a new champion. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of the match and new VCA Hardcore Champion, Daniel Miraculous! <laughs>
now, Jake is now in control of this contest. And now, I can't believe, I can't believe she Calvin getting his cheap shots in on Scotty. Jake pounding away on, on Spidey. And now Spidey got to deal with She Calvin and Jake. But Jake is the le legal competitor in the match. And now Jake with an elbow, a cover, a count. And now Spidey with a shot to the midsection. Make it three. Oh my goodness! And you know what? That might that shot right there would have probably locked not Spidey kind of loopy right there. Jake was that short clothesline. And now once again, Jake stomping the midsection of, of Spidey. And now Jake ahead of Steve. Runs in, runs into Spidey. Spidey moves out the way. And now Spidey is just trying to chop down the big man Jake. And now Spidey looking for another bulldog. And he gets it. And I don't know. I, maybe Spidey is saying, This is it. I would have finished Jake off right there. But now, Spidey, top rope. Jake is it's almost like waiting for him. I thought Jake was going to catch him the way he was standing there. But Jake kicks out at two. On, and now, Spidey. Oh, Calvin trips up Spidey in the ring. Turns around, Jake. Sit out, powerball. Swan Buster, if you want to, three. 